Hi, it's Dr. Andrea Mills with Restoration Chiropractic. I'm here to talk to you a little bit about the birth process and how it can create a situation where your child has a subluxation. Um, a subluxation is a misaligned vertebrae that is actually impeding how the nervous system is communicating to the body. And it's something that chiropractors have been aware of really since we came into existence in 1895. Um, but it's something that's very misunderstood in both the medical and public eye. And so I just want to chat with you a little bit about it. There is a German doctor named Biedermann who in 1992 came up with the concept of a KISS syndrome, K-I-S-S. -S. And what he said was that the, the birth process could create a misalignment in the upper cervical spine. So that would be like at the top of the neck here. And that that misalignment could have negative impacts on how the baby was developing. And the risk factors that he said were contributing to this KISS syndrome were long labors, C-sections, twins or triplets because of how the baby babies are squashed in the uterus, and then extraction with like vacuums or forceps, that kind of thing. And then also prenatal positional anomalies. Well, what is that? That is that the baby is not sitting in the uterus in a comfortable manner. Maybe it's twisted up, its neck is like that. All of those things could lead to KISS syndrome. And what he said in 1992 was that this KISS syndrome could actually impact how the child received information from the environment, and it could impact how the brain develops, because the brain does develop based on its interactions with the environment. It does not develop in a vacuum. So if it has good input coming in, it develops in a healthy manner. If it has negative input coming in, or if it has input coming in that feels scary or feels frightening, then the child might develop with behavioral issues. Um, and you might see that in things like they get really, really aggressive or they kind of freeze and they don't want to do anything. So in 1992, this KISS syndrome came out. It was, um, it was published in one of the medical journals. And again, it's something that chiropractors have known for 123 years. So I want to share that with you. If you have a child that is maybe not developing the way you want it to, get them into a good pediatric chiropractor. You can find a list of them at icpaforkids.org. That's the International Chiropractic Pediatric Association. And obviously, if you're in Calabasas, Woodland Hills, or West Hills, I would love to chat with you. So it's Dr. Andrea Mills with Restoration Chiropractic. Have a good day, and I'll see you soon. Bye.